Alright, I'm back with another one. I guess uh, we're going to call these car chronicles. You feel me? <laughs> Anyways, um, I'm in Cali right now, Bay Area. It's about 8, 8.30. And uh, this shit kind of crossed my mind. I wanted to make a video about it. So, this is a subject that kind of been in the... Uh, the zeitgeist of popular culture lately, especially hip hop culture in amongst black people. Hip hop culture in general, really, because uh, this guy, 6ix9ine, did something really uh, polarizing over the past couple of years. And uh, I think he's getting what he deserves lately, you know what I mean? Uh, but. I guess that's all a matter of perspective and degrees. But anyways, what I really want to talk to you about is this term, snitching. You know what snitching is? Do you have any idea? Do like, you have the background? You know, like, can you understand it? I mean, everybody should have a kind of an understanding of what snitching is, what it feels like to be a snitch. And what it feels like to be snitched on because it kind of happens growing up, like when you're a child, you know what I mean? Like, nobody likes a tattletale, right? Um, but at the same time, um, there are certain shit, uh, certain things that you should tell about. Like, I don't think there's anything wrong with whistleblowing. You know what I mean? Uh, but whistleblowing is different than snitching. Let me tell you the difference. So, say I'm a whistleblower, right? Say I'm a police officer, where my job is to protect and serve. And the actions that I actually do are closer to hurting and disrupting by right if you're being a good policeman you should whistle blow on the people who aren't a snitch a snitch on the other hand um it's a little bit different because we're doing something we all agree to do. Now, I don't give a fuck if you have a change of heart. I don't give a fuck if you get caught. If we agree to do something together and you run and tell Hey, we did this, or he did this, or she did this. That's snitching. Hold on. Let me make a better example, because I don't feel like I really uh, made that crystal clear. We are doing something we should not be doing together. We all know, as a whole, we're doing something we shouldn't be doing, and if we get caught, we're going to get in trouble. So number one, especially if you get caught, don't nobody else get caught, you better not open your bitch ass mouth. Two. If don't nobody say nothing, ain't nothing gonna happen. So don't let your guilt get to you. Stop being with the bitch shit. If you don't be down with the shit, if, if you don't wanna be down with the shit. But once you get down with the shit, you gotta be down with the shit. It's just that simple. <laughs> like it's not that hard. But I give you one more though. I'ma give you one more though. Cause this the worst of the worst of the worst. Cause I don't get, I don't think it's the same thing. I people, I think people get it misconstrued. 
There's a difference between a snitch and a motherfucking rat. <laughs> what I'm talking about when I say that. When I say it's a difference between a snitch and a rat, a rat can be an ongoing snitch. A rat, a rat is like a confidential informant. A rat is like a motherfucking The worst of the worst The, the rat That's that motherfucker that's He acting like he your motherfucking friend every day He's still dapping you off Calling you round Giving you the little gang member handshakes Going all up in the air with the shit and all that shit And he going to report to them people once a week Telling them every little thing that go down That's a motherfucking rat now, me personally, don't get it twisted. I came up in the hood. I, I've been around a lot of gangster shit. I ain't no motherfucking gangster. I ain't no motherfucking thug. It's just not who I am. I, I've been around it. I've seen... And I don't trust people enough to do anything with none of y'all motherfuckers anyway. Best believe that. But, um, yeah. Long story short, um, I hope I broke that down to y'all very clearly. Um, don't be a rat or a snitch. It's just not cool. Um... If you want to be a whistleblower, that's fine with me. Um, like, and if you ain't down with the shit, then you, it's by all means, if you're a straight up civilian and you ain't like what's going on, go run, tell that. I don't have no problem with that. But now if you're going to be down with some shit, you're going to get in that car. If you're going to get in that car, knowing who the fuck you get in that car with, you got to be down whatever the fuck you take what come with that point blank period. That's why you got to boycott everything that 6 9 is and stand for because we can't let motherfuckers get away with shit like that. It's about the principle. It's not about who they are, what they did. It's about the fucking principle. Nobody likes a fucking tattletale.